Yo, what's up, YouTube? I'm TJ, and welcome to the channel. Today, we're reacting to dash cam moments so crazy you think it's fake. Let's get into it. Hey, adrenaline junkies. Welcome to Mind Rush, where adrenaline means pure excitement. Ah, yeah. Dive into heart pounding chases. Yeah. It's gonna get real. We want those thrilling moments. If you're looking for the ultimate rush, mm -hmm. let's get your heart racing. Get it racing. We in there. We in there. August 18th, 2024. Andre T. <clears throat> Hunter turns Washington Street into his personal racetrack, blasting through town in a red Dodge Ram like he's uh, a mission for Fast and Furious 20. I went there before, bro. I drove there before. Oh, like shit. A minor inconvenience. Let's see what they own. Hey, learn how to drive, man. He almost got his friend crashed. You know what I meant. <clears throat> Dang. Yeah, he ain't stopping. Yeah, he ain't stopping. Yep, of course. Bro, you is not getting nowhere with that truck, bro. Oh. Hey, yo, what? Oh, okay, this is this is a different angle, I believe. It's probably a different angle. I don't know. There ain't no way that that truck the just got up. Pro level okay, there you go. Take out his truck and send it rolling off the road. And hey, the wheel fell off and everything. Hmm. He strolls out like nothing happened, casually sipping a bush beer like it's halftime at the Super Bowl. Absolute legend. He's an absolute legend. <laughs> Comment below if you think he's a legend. Woke up, your hands up. Hands up. Oh, yeah, yeah. Cops swoop in, slap the cuffs on, and off he goes to the oh, hospital yeah. with a sore shoulder. Andre now faces a laundry list of charges. Driving drunk, driving on a suspended license, and, just to top it off, driving with an open beer can. Moral of the story. Damn. Don't drink and drive, and definitely don't think you can outrun the law. <laughs> Bro, hey, hey, I ain't saying I can or can't, but hey, if, let me not. Let me not. <clears throat> That's a nice car right there. That's a nice Lexus. July 18th, 2024. Trooper A. Cass spots a black four door car flying down I 630 at 77 miles per hour. 77. On what? I'm not gonna rewind it. Make sure I'm recording. <clears throat> but the driver, Becca Smith, didn't have a license, music. registration, oh. or insurance. A hat trick of bad decisions. Ooh, she finna try to get away. As Trooper Cass runs her info, bam, she floors it. The chase is on. <laughs> Bro, I wonder if those chargers are actually fast or they just sound fast. It looks like they got slow startup speed, but the end speed, the top speed is cool. The top speed is cool, I believe. I don't know. Let me know. <clears throat> Bro, I drove on this highway too. I ain't gonna pause it too much, but you know what I'm saying? You know what? I can pause it even time I want to. I'm talking about. I was not, I was not, I was not. <laughs> but no, nah, I was a trucker for like five plus, I'm gonna say five plus years. So I'll recognize a lot of stuff. If I see it, I'm gonna recognize it, Mike. I'll probably, I'll probably recognize it. It's crazy. It's wild. I've been everywhere. I've been there. 
That's crazy. They were like Nashville. I don't know what they said. They got a. Oh, she got away, didn't she? Oh, she. F Running red lights, blasting through stop signs, and pushing past 100 miles per hour. She's going full action movie mode. I ain't gonna lie, females are crazy when they start driving fast. I don't know if it's panic mode or they just got some real skill or some of them. No, I know, I know a couple of them got real skill, I ain't gonna lie. Ooh, that was a nice turn. Hey, that Lexus is floating. Look at it. See, that's, you see what I'm saying? That charger just sound loud. Okay. I see what he's doing. Oh, yeah. I don't think she can draw. No, she can. She can. Hit it right. Or left. Oh. Left, right. <laughs> The cops can't drive. <laughs> oh. Okay, so she can't drive. She, I think she a cop. Who driving? Bro, my camera sucks. But it all comes to an end when Trooper <clears throat> Cass pulls a tactical move, slamming the car into a guardrail. It flips and rolls into the median, ejecting mm. the real driver. Bro, she can drive. Dang, but it ain't got top speed. Ooh! For the kill that woman? Hit the edge of the guardrail. Bro, there's a time and a place to do a maneuver like that, bro. Why, why would you do a maneuver like that? Like right there, there you can see the edge of the. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? It happens. It happens. Spurs of the moments. You know what I'm saying? That's crazy. There's a warrant waiting for her arrest. Lesson learned. She tried to run though. It happens. That's what happens though. Real fast. <clears throat> Damn, had no seat built. Dang. I don't know if I gotta blur this. That was, that was just a log, I think. September 4th, 2024, Littleton, Colorado, just after 2.30 a.m., and things are already getting wild. What's going on here? Dang. Five David 3 2, they just lost the trailer. Douglas County deputies roll up to a salvage yard after reports of a burglary in progress. Enter 29-year-old oh. Brenton Zyler, who isn't going down quietly. Zyler's driving a stolen Toyota Tundra yeah. and thinks he's in Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> yeah, that truck messed up. Dang, still driving though. Uh, we in Florida, I think. Or South Carolina. I think we in Florida, right? I'm probably way off. Hold on. <laughs> you just adding charges to yourself. What? He's firing at the police. Shame. Bussing. Ain't no way. The chase finally screeches to a halt when Zyler crashes near Village Greens Park in Greenwood Village. They probably didn't even fire. Did they fire for real? Oh. Zyler's wild night ends in a crash. Oh. They didn't even shoot no gun. You can't shoot your way out of trouble, especially when your getaway car is stolen. And losing a wheel. July 19th, 2022, Mulberry, Arkansas. Meet Robert Regal, or at what least up, Robert? that's what he's calling himself. This guy's got a Chevy Silverado rental, 
a buddy in the passenger seat, a pregnant woman in the back, and one hell of an excuse for running from the cops. What? His brain Don't tumor made him do it. <laughs> the chase kicks off at 7.20 p.m., and it's on for 12 minutes of high-speed drama. Damn. Make that U-turn in. Make that U-turn in. Dang, four cops though? I get it though. They want to have fun. <clears throat> One cop gets close enough to pull a pit maneuver, but Robert's not done showing <laughs> off. He dodges it at the last second. Bruh. The person in that truck cannot drive. I get it though. I get it though. Mulberry. Shout out Mulberry. <laughs> yeah, I laid no pads yet. No, you ain't pit maneuvering me. Hey, hit him with something because you ain't you ain't go you ain't go beat him through horsepower. Go to the dirt road or something. Turn the right. Make a right. Oh, you're just gonna make a left. <laughs> make a right. Go in the dirt somewhere. <laughs> oh yeah, it's over with. Oh, bro, you could have just. Damn. That was crazy. Ah. January 2nd, 2023. It's 10.35 a.m. and Georgia State Patrol is teaming up with East Point Police to take down 19-year-old fugitive Matthew. Listen to this. There's so much potential. There's no excuses anymore. Gaskins. This guy's been causing chaos across multiple jurisdictions, and today, he's driving a stolen Jeep Grand Cherokee like he's got something to prove. <laughs> Cornered on Washington Road, Gaskins decides he's not done yet, flooring it and even tearing through someone's Illinois? backyard in a last-ditch attempt to escape. Are you in a Jeep? When I say go in the dirt or drive, off-road I don't mean like that I didn't tell him that but it was <laughs> like they, they like I can hear me oh uh, yeah oh yeah it's over with you probably know how to drive we're gonna see Troopers hit him with pit maneuvers left and right, but he keeps dodging them like it's a game of bumper cars. He damages a few cars along the way, but it's all over when Gaskins finds himself boxed in a parking lot. Ah, uh, yup. That's the worst part right there. Oh! A few cars along the way, but it's all over when Gaskins finds himself boxed in a parking lot. That Jeep was airborne. If it could still drive, bruh, that's gonna be crazy. 
Yeah, it's over with. It's over with. One last pit sends him crashing into a power pole, and his ride is officially over. Oh, yeah, it's toast. over. Yeah, it's over. This wild chase finally comes to an end. Bro, he's just like bumper car. Oh, watch out, yo. Bro, that's like real life GTA right there. Dude had four stars. The dude had four stars. That was crazy. May 30th, 2018, Hudson, Wisconsin, and Cassidy Mickey, 33, is driving like he's got something to prove. We got to prove. After stealing a truck in St. Croix County, he's leading the cops on a multi-town chase, showing off his off-roading skills in a quiet neighborhood. Off-roading. Let's see how this go. Let's see how this go. Look like you hopefully got a, looks like you got a four, four, four by four, four by four. Hopefully it ain't two wheel drive. The wheel fell off? Already? Oh. I'm over here like I I thought he said his wheel fell off. Why do cars like fall apart so easily? Off road. That charger's keeping up. Is that charger four wheel drive? Oh yeah, it's over for you. You toast. That truck is over with for that truck. <laughs> nah, nah, he still got a chance. Hey, hey, Lizzie driving in the grass right now. Yeah, he just noticed that didn't work. What you gonna do now? Okay, okay, a little more off-roading. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. oh he getting all that property damage. Oh, damn. Oh, he, he look like he in a wealthy neighborhood. This is a T-bone crash, then rips through someone's driveway and across their yard like he's auditioning for Monster Jam. But the fun ends when Lutine Standard takes a point blank shot. Game over for Cassidy. It's over with. Turns out Cassidy stole the truck from a dealership near Deer Park. He's now facing a laundry list of charges, including burglary and reckless endangerment. Nine other charges got dropped after he took a plea deal, but he's still looking at 10 years, five in prison, five on supervision. Was that truck really worth 10 years behind bars? Unless it came with free Wi-Fi and a jacuzzi, probably not. Not even for that. <laughs> what? <laughs> I've been there before so many times. Where we at? Bro, where we at? Kentucky? 
On US we in Kentucky. 65 near Harrison, a deputy clocked Harrison, a car where? flying at 80 miles per hour in a 45 zone. Lights, sirens, the works. But when the car looked like it was slowing down, the deputy turned off the sirens. Big mistake. The driver had other plans and kept on evading. So, sirens back on, and the chase was on. Hmm. Hmm. What are they gonna do? Oh uh, yeah. The driver cut through residential neighborhoods and onto the road. But it wasn't long before the deputy hit him with a perfect pit maneuver, sending the car spinning and stopping it cold. What is that? Oh, it's over with. Oh, that is one of those eclipses. Oh, he think he fast curious. Bro, he gonna tell his friends that he did some fast furious shit. Some fast furious joint. With the push bar pinning the car, backup arrived, and the yeah. suspect was pulled out and cuffed without a peep. Game over. Mm -hmm. We get this lane open. It's like traffic by or whatever. Yeah. But, uh, hey, 14. Bro, he ain't getting nowhere. September 20th, 2023. Toledo Tennessee? police spot Ryan Hasselbach Toledo. tearing through the streets in his pickup truck like he's in the Indy 500. Lights, sirens, the works. But Ryan? Nope, not stopping. He punches <laughs> the gas and the chase is on. Toledo, Oklahoma? Oh yeah. We somewhere. Let me know. Crashes straight into oh, an yo. School. and not just any room, but eight-year-old Charlie's special needs classroom. That massive hole in the room. Oh, it's over with, bruh. Nah, ain't no way he just crashed into no classroom, a special needs classroom at that. In the middle school, it's over with. His name is Timothy to an elementary school and not just any room, but elementary. Eight year old Charlie's special needs classroom. Charlie, that massive hole in the wall. Yep. Courtesy of Ryan's truck. Now, Charlie's a brave kid battling Batten disease, a rare genetic disorder that's stolen his eyesight and is taking more every day. His classroom was filled with all the special tools he needed to learn until Ryan decided to make it his personal parking spot. $150,000 to the school. That was a crazy joke, bro. His truck. Now Charlie's a brave kid, battling Batten disease, a rare genetic disorder that's stolen his eyesight and is taking more every day. That's crazy. That's his crazy. His classroom was filled with all the special tools he needed to learn until Ryan decided to make it his personal parking spot. Yeah, that's great. $150,000 to the school, and let's not even start on Charlie's learning equipment. Ryan, he had no idea what a mess he'd made as cops dragged him out of the truck and slapped on the cuffs. Ryan's now facing charges for failure to comply, obstructing official business, and vandalism. If you're running mm. from the cops, maybe avoid crashing into schools, especially one where kids like Charlie need all the support they can get. <laughs> This driver from San Francisco found right. out the hard way when his rear Let Charlie learn, man. right tire gave out while cruising down the highway. Mm. He swerved right, yanked the wheel left, and bam, straight into the concrete barricade. By some miracle, he walked away with barely a scratch. That's great. That bulky pickup? Probably the only reason he's not in worse shape. Sometimes Bro, how driving a tank though? on wheels has its perks. Oh, look at that gasoline. Where we at? Meet Roy Flowers, a name the cops in Jonesboro, oh. Arkansas. Arkansas. Know all too well. Close. Back in 2019, Close. at the ripe age of 58, Roy was busted on multiple drug charges. During the raid, 
Police found two pistols, some smoking pipes, two? a few baggies, and a bunch of digital scales. Quite the collection. State trooper Nash Thomas spots Roy's truck and catches him in the act of selling drugs. Time to see Damn. if Roy's ready to play nice or make things interesting. Oh, he ain't get nowhere. He ain't get nowhere with that head start. Oh, he is over with. You know, the skinny street with that type of truck. Better get off road. <laughs> Trying to juke him or something? No, that ain't gonna work, my brother. Yep, turn her, turn her right. Yep. Bro, what is this? That's not gonna trick the cops. What are they, they gonna do it with you? No, bro. Drive. <laughs> What's up, homie? How this going in? What, bro? <laughs> oh, bro, why is he driving like he playing football or something? He doing? Oh, oh. Like, come on, bro. This is not football, man. Oh, off road. Now you go off road. Okay. Let's see how you do it. Bro, that was the worst. <laughs> this dude drunk. <laughs> up ahead, Bro. the cops set up a roadblock to reel him in. But Roy's no rookie. He spots it last second and swerves into a parking lot. Oh, that was smooth. The chase is on, and Trooper Thomas is pushing his cruiser oh. to the max. Oh. I mean, what do you got to do? That ain't his car. My fault. I didn't, I didn't mean to attack. You know what I'm saying? I didn't mean to do none of that like that. Right? Oh, oh, bruh. Why is you in the wrong place? This dude gotta be drunk. This dude in a commute. Whoa, bruh. What are you doing? Oh, <laughs> I mean, I get, I get what you're trying to do, but oh my, bro, a box car can get in, go through all that. Make it something challenging, bro. You in a whole neighborhood, bro, a community. Somebody could have been doing Apple Jacks or whatever you call it, the square things on the ground. Oh. Oh, yeah, I can handle it. Yeah, he is pushing that charger to the max ankle. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bruh. He in the dead end? Oh. But, okay. Okay. Yeah, make a different route now, man. This dude having fun. He may having the time of his life, bro. No kizzy. Okay. According to the Craighead County Sheriff's Office, 63-year-old Roy was charged with fleeing, unpaid fines, and violating his parole. Looks like old habits die hard. Ah. If we had to guess, he was still on parole from his 2019 escapades when Trooper He's still Thomas trying to juke him. him over. Yeah, yeah, it's over with. All right, y'all, that was the video. 
appreciate you if you was watching. If you enjoyed though, Spartan kick that like button and subscribe. Comment below if you want me to react to anything else. You know what I'm saying? Give me suggestions. You know what I'm saying? Hit that bell. And I'll see you next time. We out.